The Frederick Consultant and Leader of his party. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And, uh, well, in the <laughs> Between the Premier and the Leader of the Official Opposition, just about everyone possible has been thanked, but in the spirit of, of gratitude uh, uh, in response to the Premier's statement here, I want to express my gratitude to him for having the foresight to uh, arrange for the Canadian Armed Forces to mobilize as soon as they were needed uh, during the flood. It made a, a huge difference, uh, Mr. Speaker, in one of the neighborhoods in my riding. Uh, I happened to be there uh, meeting with residents and constituents, and, and they were there doing wellness checks. And I know in particular the seniors appreciated that, as did others that provided a tremendous level of comfort. And then when the flood really hit and the water started pouring into that same neighborhood, the city was able to direct the Armed Forces personnel to that neighborhood to make a practical difference to help stem the, the flow of water and, and uh, uh, minimize, the, well I wouldn't say minimize, but at least reduce the amount of flooding that otherwise would have happened uh, in, in uh, some people's homes. So they made a, a, a real difference in terms of people's sense of security uh, and comfort as well as a practical difference in helping to hold back uh, some of the flood waters, uh, Mr. Speaker. So I want to extend my gratitude to the Premier for that, uh, that foresight. Uh, also to Deputy Minister of Public Safety, Mike Como, uh, for being so available uh, to, to those of us who uh, needed uh, assistance for our constituents. Uh, he was always there and prepared to act uh, quickly. And he, when he wasn't there, Andrew Easton was uh, from EMO. Uh, I'd also like to acknowledge, uh, of course, and it's been mentioned, but the Red Cross and the tremendous volunteers working with them who played such an important role in uh, helping people who had to leave their homes. Uh, and uh, not enough can be said uh, about, about the Red Cross and the good they do, uh, Mr. Speaker. So I wanted to uh, acknowledge them as well. Now we're into the cleanup. Um, many, many people will be involved in that and uh, there will be many people to thank in future um, as a result of their efforts in the cleanup, um, Mr. Speaker. But uh, really, those, those are the things I wanted to, to add to the Premier's statement and take the opportunity to uh, thank him.